This thing is very cool looking. We're, Super groovy. And uh, we, when we got it, we took it out of the, the box and uh, loved the way it looked. And then we plugged it in and said, holy crap, this thing sounds like a million bucks. Let's do a video. So here we are, yeah. Um, it's obviously looking like an Explorer, right? But it's got a slimmer waistline. Uh, it's been, you know, dieting over the holidays. and uh, Something that everyone could use after this... Uh... <laughs> Merry Christmas season. That's right. So, uh, yeah, so the Xtura Prophecy, uh, this one is uh, what they call a black um, aged gloss finish here. So, um, basically, it's similar to an Explorer in, in its makeup here. It's um, all mahogany. You've got a mahogany everything here with the body. Mahogany. Let's see the back of that bad boy. Mahogany neck as well. Um We'll get to and this. It's a real set neck guitar, too. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. And a nice slim taper on this neck, too. It's very 60s feeling. Um, yeah, and you'll notice that the uh, fingerboard is ebony. I'm a big fan of an ebony fingerboard. And, uh, ebony. <laughs> yeah, no, sorry. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, and these cool inlays that you just saw, those mm -hmm. are very, very uh, hip as well. Um, also, we're not done, Greg. We've oh. got. Uh, Oh, Rover. yeah. Rover. Locking tuners. Rover locking tuners on this thing. Man, Epiphone has really... They really st stepped up their game in the last year, I'll tell you. Uh, I totally agree. All the stuff that we've been getting from Epiphone of late has been really, really high I'm quality. taking one of these bad boys home for me at some point. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, uh, let's talk about uh, the pickups here, because as we said, you know, this thing, when we plugged it in, we went, oh, okay, this thing sounds amazing. So, uh, the pickups... Are made by Fishman, Fishman Fluence pickups, um, and uh, there's all kinds of things going on here that we're going to have to break down for you. Uh, when I was showing you the back, you notice that there's a battery compartment there, so they're active pickups. And so what we have here are two push uh, push pull pots here, and what they do is, first of all, on the volume knobs push pull it's a coil split so we've got the humbucker full on here in the bridge i don't have much distortion on my marshall right now but uh, and then we'll kind of pop it up here and now we've got more of a, a single coil flavor there kind of vintagey sound in there same thing goes for the neck pickup. That's the full on humbucker, and I do the tap here. And we get more of kind of a, you know, PAF style pickup there. So then let me go back to the bridge, I guess, and uh, we'll get it in the humbucker mode. And uh, this push pull pot over here on the tone knob is. A, they call it like vintage and modern. So there's some, sort of different voicings uh, available to us on this push-pull pot on the tone knob. So this sounds to me like it's the modern flavor. And then we kind of roll it back. And, and there's a slight tonal shift there that they call it like more of a vintage style. So... Same goes for the neck pickup as well. So we got the my 
humbucker in the modern mode and then pop this baby up and now you're in more vintage mode. <laughs> So the modern mode, the modern mode, um, has more gain to it. Is part of yeah, the thing with yeah. it, and also that mode also works when you're using the coil tap. Yeah, that's so what you I'm... can have vintage and modern on the coil tap as well. Yeah, so there's some variables variables that you can throw in there, and uh, I think it's this uh, obviously from the look of the guitar, it's kind of geared more towards uh, metal. Uh, but it's cool to have those options to kind of get more of a throwback 70s vibe to it as well. You know. I'm going to play it in my blues band. <laughs> pickup in the vintage setting there and we are big fans of the neck pickup just the way it sounds for like leads and stuff like that and that vintage <laughs> Yeah, this careful, careful, the phone device. could be leaving my hand at any... Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, that's when you start, you start singing there. I love, ready? I love... No? Okay. Put your shirt back on, Greg. Okay, so... <laughs> oh, is this the last video we will ever make? This will be the last video you'll ever make. <laughs> All right, so there it is, the uh, 20, this is 2020. Uh, Turn even, that sucker up and let's hear some... Uh, this is the Epiphone Extura Prophecy uh, in the... Uh, reasonably Prophecy. priced as well. Oh, yeah, man, it's Epiphone. And we got a couple more coming that we're probably going to show you. We are. Uh, there's the Tiger Stripey one that we can't wait to see. They and also make a couple of Vs. Oh, cool. And they also make some Les Pauls in that, and we have all of them coming. Awesome. Okay. Well, look forward to seeing some more of that. So here we go. Uh, let's rock out. Thank you guys very much for watching and subscribing and sharing all these videos with a friend. And we'll see you next time.